Hey guys, it is Brittany from Coffee Planner Mom, and I am here today planning in my classic size happy planner, and it is the week of September 17th through the 23rd. Now, according to Google, the 22nd is the first day of fall. Um, I've seen seen a couple of like different dates for it, but I'm gonna just go with what, when I searched, it said it was the 22nd. So because of that, two things. Um, first, this is gonna be a very fall themed spread, but I'm also doing a collab with my friend Bethany over at Plan With Bethy Dean. Um, so definitely go and check out her video. What we're doing though um, is, it's a little bit different than the last collab I did. We're actually gonna be doing a Q&A collab. So this will be a little bit longer than my normal videos because I'll be answering some fall themed questions. So it should be a lot of fun. So I think what I'm gonna do is I think I'm gonna be going in the seasonal, probably the squad goals, and the holidays and seasons little sticker pad because it does have a couple of really cute, here we go, fall stickers. So the thing is this has gold foiling and I was thinking about doing rose gold foil but like literally every sticker is gold foil. So I think I might end up going with a gold foil spread. Um, not sure for washi but we shall see how this pans out. So the first question is what symbolizes fall and makes it feel like the season has started? Um, for me, that's Christmas. Can't wait for Christmas. Um, that's actually what I'm looking for. Um, so for me, what really makes it feel as if it's fall is, sorry, I've got like stuff everywhere because I'm a hot mess. Um, if you're coming over from Bethany's channel, hi, um, that's just me. I'm a hot mess. So what makes it feel like fall to me is really when I start to see leaves falling on the ground. Um, I was walking through my neighborhood. Actually, no, I was driving through and saw it and I wanted to take a walk so I could see the leaves um, because I was just like, oh my gosh, it's fall. Um, and really it's the smell of the leaves. So like, you guys know what I mean, right? Like, you can just, you smell it. It's, oh, it's such a wonderful smell. I just, I love it. That's what makes it just feel like the season has started. And funny enough, it actually started feeling like that in August. It was the last weekend of August, which honestly doesn't surprise me just because of how just random our weather has been. These are really cute. I might end up using those probably going to end up using that bike though. It's really cute. You know what? Yeah, let's just go with it. want to be a little bit more decisive. Ooh. Um, also something else, we have a lot of like farms over by me. I live in a fairly rural area. Um, all things considered that is. So do I want it? Yeah, you know what? I am normally a chronological planner, so I use my boxes morning, afternoon, and evening. So I have something going on Tuesday evening, but I kind of just want to put the bike down here. Like, I don't know. I just think it would look really cute, so I'm I'm going with it. I want to try to be more decisive, so we'll just do that. Um, question two is, what is your favorite fall family tradition, outing, or memory. So I live in Pennsylvania now and I, I grew up in New Jersey, moved to Maryland for, let me see what I've got going on over here. Hold on. Okay. So the squad goals, that's right. There's only like six total full boxes in the squad goals because there's like these clear papers, more functional based things. And then lots of girls, which I really like the girls. I might end up throwing a couple girls on my page. And then these banners look cute. How do they compare to... Yeah, the leaves are pretty similar. I think I could mix and match them. Um, anyway, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. So I grew up in New Jersey, moved to Maryland. And then finally, when I came up to Pennsylvania... We um, started on, I've got two different things I'm trying to look at, my questions and my plans. Uh, but we started to go ahead and 
go to this one um, orchard and it's a farmer's market and an orchard and we we went there the one year I didn't know that they had an actual section where you could like pick your own everything whatever is in season you can pick it so you could pick your own strawberries blueberries peaches apples pumpkins like everything you just walk out into their farm I'm trying to find um, a checklist right now I know it's here somewhere that was another sticker I was considering using but I thought the oh fall it's nice to see you again felt a little more like boom because I'll show you where is it this is the one I really wanted and I wanted it in like one of these scripty clear sticker like font things but apparently and I had this on my Instagram it's only in the um, memory keeping like the dates and holidays sticker so I don't have it I'll probably use this in my mini because like I really want to use it this week I just don't see myself using greens so anyway here's the list that I was looking for we're gonna go with the like Merlot color because I've got it on the page already and in the bicycle so the first year we were here in Pennsylvania yes I'm still telling my story did not forget it um I should probably do like a header maybe I should go with or oh you know what if I go yeah you know what All right, we'll bring the color in and I'll use it. I'll find a way. Oh, that's okay. It went um, sticky side up, so that's fine. Um, this at least gives me the option if I want to add that collapsed into fall. Um, so, yeah, so the first year I went and I thought it was just a farmer's market. So I just picked up our pumpkins in the farmer's market. And then I realized after following them on Facebook, like, hey, I could have been going to actually pick everything myself so now I know and that is what I do do I want to use the other one I don't know it's gonna do another one over here because I do have quite a bit of things to do on Thursday I guess we shall see um let's see I am gonna need a box like I said I'm probably going to be pulling in so yeah let me just do that We'll use the colorful boxes because I said I'm going to pull in gold foil. So I might as well just do Wow, I've used a lot. It's fine. Um, so I'm still trying to tell the same story. Man. It's all right. Ooh. Let's see if there's any just like decorative boxes. That's pretty, but I already have that color here. So, yeah, so then the next year, because I had learned and I followed the farm on Facebook, I saw that they actually had the U pick. So then we ended up going and picking apples. And we put, it was so funny, we picked a half bushel. No, it was a full, it was a bushel. We picked a bushel of apples. When they're like, they hand, they, you know, they sell the bags and they're like, do you want one bushel or two I'm like I guess just one and they gave me this bag I'm like wow that's a big bag I got home and the bag was bigger than a gallon of paint it was huge I didn't know what to do with all of these apples so that was a very fun time but now we actually oh okay so it's got all those so um at this point now we actually do go ahead and get all of the apples I know what to do with the apples now so we go and we go to the farm we pick the apples we I'm gonna offset this and I'll do it down here actually do I want to cover up that line maybe I do yeah you know what why not let's just ignore the lines today no because that's kind of crooked can I peel this up without no I don't think I can so we'll just use some undo and get it all fixed and it'll be fine. It also gives me a chance to finish the story that I've been telling for like 20 minutes now. I mean, not actually 20 minutes, I know, but feels like it. So we go every year. So that is our family tradition. We pick, we always pick apples. Sometimes we don't pick the pumpkins. Um, sometimes we get there a little too late. Sometimes we're there too early and it's just not... Um, a good pumpkin season or you know like time we just like missed it or whatever 
which is fine. Yeah, I, I so badly want to offset it. I just, I cannot help myself, so we'll just do it here. Um, they also have a corn maze, so that's really fun to do. So yeah, it's just, it's a, it's a good time all around. That'll dry and it'll be fine. Don't worry about it. Um, so yeah, it's been really cute because like I, I've been going there since I, we had just the girls and I should probably put down the other videos. So I know I'm going to need to do Friday. For, so these are for my videos that I'm going to be doing. So Monday is my mini Friday is going to be, Hey, um, my regular plan with me. And then I still have not done my flip through. I'll probably end up posting that in between my mini and my monthly, which is fine. Um, Thursday, yeah, probably, you know what? I'll just stick this up here just to try to space things out and keep it all offset. Um, I'll get that flip through up at some point. So we've been going there since it was just, we were a family of four, we had just the girls. So then there's, you know, pictures of my kids growing up in this orchard. So it's, I love it. Um, what else do we need to do today? We're gonna bring in the orange and the green. So we'll do the green right here. This is gonna be for soccer. Um, so Tuesday, can't really do too much over there. So we're going to put this one going this way. And then these are from Lil Annabelle's Plans. These are the Soccer Rosie and Soccer Tete stickers. And I think what I'll do, I will put, yeah, okay. So just trying to like evaluate the color. So she's in pink. So I'm gonna put her over here with the green so that it's not like blue on green and then pink on orange. Just try to give it a little bit of contrast. Um, I don't think I moved on to the next question yet. So let me just get these down and then I will do question number three. Um, by the way, these boxes came from the actual seasonal sticker book um, that I was, that I've been pulling from so far. So we got those. I am gonna need to do, and maybe, cause I don't think that there's any other colors in here that would go with the colors I've been using. So like you've got these blues and greens and then you've got like these pinks and then these cooler tones. So I think we're just going to stick with, yeah, we'll go with this one because it's, or I think, wait. Okay, so those are just like slightly bigger than this. I mean, that's what it looks like, but then I also have these boxes, but I don't think I need those boxes. So we'll go with one of these. So Tuesday and Thursdays are practices. Saturday is the game. So I coach my daughter and then my son also plays. But last week and this week, so I'm filming this on Saturday. I try really hard to film on Fridays because like Saturdays I get a little bit tired because, um, I coach my daughter, but she is at an age where I actually have to be out on the field running around with them because we don't have refs. So you're coaching and refing. So that's fun. Um, but it's, I, I'm old. <laughs> I feel like I'm old. It makes me very tired. I end up with like 10,000 steps in that one. It's not even an hour game. It's a 32 minute game. And I have like 10,000 is a slight exaggeration. It's only 8,000 steps. So I try to film on Fridays, but today is Saturday and I'm filming today. And I was going somewhere with that. And now I've just lost the train of thought. I remember what it was. It was to say that today I was only able to see half of my son's game because I was at my daughter's game coaching it. And last week it was the same thing because it was nine and 10 o'clock games, but over here they're split up by two hours. So I'll be able to see all of his game and coach her. So yeah, that's what that was about. I'm gonna be doing a lot more deco. I haven't done any full boxes, but I know I want to incorporate the leaves. Um, 
not necessarily those. I mean, I'm probably going to use them. Let's be honest. They're cute. But I'm trying to find them. Yeah, these leaves and these are the ones that I'm really thinking I'm going to end up going with. They're so pretty. Um, gosh, what is it? Laisa dot PWM, I think, had this really awesome spread of like leaves blowing across her page. And I don't think if I tried that I could do it justice, but man, it was gorgeous. Really quick, what I want to do is um, just put down, I don't even know what I want to put down. I guess we'll go with the broom because why not? So these are gold foiled cleaning icons from Rose Colored Days. So Monday, this list is going to be quite a bit of cleaning. So we'll stick that there. And then before I forget, I do want to put down a checklist for Thursday. So I guess what I'll do is I will go with, I really like that color though. So I'm very tempted, but I think what I might do is go with like the green, although Oh, I can't get to my planner. It's buried under like a box of washi right now. You know what? Let's just do it. I don't normally, oh, there was only one to-do sticker in that color. So you know what? I have two in the orange, so I'll just use one of those oranges. Or, ooh, no, we'll go with this darker. You can't see it because it's upside down on my finger. All right. So it's a darker green to do. So we will go ahead with that one. And question number three is what is my favorite fall drink? Um, I, I'm a hot coffee drinker year round. So I would have to say that I think it was last fall. My Starbucks had like a s'mores coffee flavor or a latte flavor, whatever it was, that was so good. Um, I, I Caramel is like my favorite, like typical fall drink. Um, occasionally I will have a little bit of apple cider, but not, not too much. Um, the orchard has fresh apple cider, so it's really nice. Ooh, this says get cozy. I'm kind of liking that. I might use that. I feel so strange right now because I don't have any full boxes, but... I'll manage. I will manage. All right, I'm going to use these orange um, books from Lily Annabelle's Plants. I'm so excited. She has, oh, so excited. She has these um, fall color stickers. She just released them yesterday, and she let me help pick the colors for the fall books. I was so excited. So, those just got released in her shop yesterday. So there's, um, I think she has books in the fall colors. I think popcorn, um, gosh, some other stuff. Washing machine stickers, which I probably should look and see if I have any of those. Didn't find them yet, but I did find her trash can stickers that I'm going to end up needing. So this is in the bold. Um, really? Did I do that? That's, wow, let me just put that down over here before I forget. All right, um, so these are in the bold colors. I'm just flipping through my little sticker book that she made for me. Oh, that's right, washi, but that's not really the right color, but oh, that reminds me, hold on. I have these laundry stickers, so let me just go with those instead. So when, all right, so laundry is gonna be one of the things over there. So I'll stick the laundry sticker here and then I'll write in that it's Towel Tuesday. Um, I My planner has helped me become so much better of a like housekeeper for my house. So I now like can easily say, oh, I have to do this, this, and this because it's in my planner and I feel more obligated to do it because it's in my planner. Um, so these are gold foil, since I'm going with gold foil. I really wanted to go with rose gold because I have the coffee stickers. Oh, that reminds me, I need coffee stickers. Man, okay. Um, and the books in the rose gold. But the fall, yeah. Which is funny though, because like I haven't actually used 
those stickers that I said I was going to use that had the foil, so I could have done rose gold, but I'm not bitter. So what else are we got over here? What is your favorite fall foods or treats? Oh my gosh. Okay. So I think this is mostly because of all of the, like the apple fiasco from the very first year. Now it's funny. I buy a bushel and a half when we go apple picking and I do apple pies, apple crepes, apple muffins. Um, I even do the pies now for Thanksgiving. Oh, these are so cute. And they're foiled. Okay, so let's see, what can I use those for? All right, I already have, for my mini and my cleaning schedule, I have towels, soccer. I don't have my Instagram post up yet. I'm still keeping track of that in here because I'm not sure about my social media planner, honestly. It's fun to do, but um, I don't always look at it. So we have library. So I need to do Washi Wednesday, and I need to do a movie, so I can't really use those for a movie, though. Instagram posts, we've got that. Instagram posts, I need to do my Manny. Yeah. All right, I don't have anything to use these for, so that's kind of sad. All right, I had to stop filming to take a phone call, so I'm trying to remember where I left off. Um, I think it was about favorite food and drinks, or favorite foods and treats. And yeah, just like anything apple really screams fall to me. Um, and I like hot chocolate this time of year too. So I guess that kind of goes under drinks. And I think I was trying to use these, but I didn't really have a space for them. Ooh, look at these little hearts. We can use those for the Instagram posts. So let's stick those down. Um, so what are we up to? Number five, how do you decorate for fall? So fall is actually a pretty low key, like decoration wise for us. Um, we do quite a bit for Halloween. Just because like over these years, like when I was in college, I bought so many Halloween decorations for my dorm freshman year. And a lot of them are, you know, like plug in jack-o-lanterns and things that like definitely hold up the test of, t no, scoot up, scoot, scoot. There we go. Um, it, like I was saying, it was stuff that like stood up to the test of time. So we have a lot of Halloween things. Sometimes what I do is I will get a like leaf garland and because when you first come into our front door, our stairs going up are right here. So I'll loop the leaf garland going up the banister. So that's one of my like favorite things to do. And then like I have so many things that I've seen on like Pinterest. Um, <laughs> yeah. Lots of Pinterest, but I um, haven't actually done any of them. Yeah, here's what we're gonna do. I don't really have much more going on on Wednesday. I mean, I have to put a popcorn sticker here. So it's not a Britney video until we take a full box and turn it onto its side. I don't really have anything else on Monday either. Although, you know what, I've got this here. So let me leave that so I have space in case like I have to write anything in. And we'll stick this, do I want to stick it down here? Or do I want to stick it up here? All right, so while that's going, um, so how do I decorate for fall? Mostly just going in straight into Halloween. Um, so we'll decorate for Halloween on the early side-ish. I guess it's kind of early. Uh, and then we, this is not cooperating. And then I start decorating for Christmas as soon as we take down Halloween basically. Um, <laughs> I, I love Christmas and the happiness. I, I'm just really looking forward to fall this year, like more so than any other year. I've been really looking forward to it. This is thoroughly saturated, so it's going to need to take a minute to dry. Um, 
So, yeah, I, uh, that's my decorating thing. And then what else do we have? We have, what are you most looking forward to this fall? And, um, you know, this fall, it's been, it's already been a pretty busy, pretty busy season because we've got two kids doing soccer right now. And I'll put it over here. Yeah, can I pick this back up? Now I'm regretting where I put it. Oh, are you serious? Oh, wait, no, okay. I still can lift it. It's still slightly damp, so, okay. Ooh, some of the sticky stayed down. That's user error, but that's fine. All right. Um, yeah, so we've got... We've got some plans coming up. I've got, um, I mean, we've got the things that we do every year, like the apple picking. Maybe we'll do the corn maze. We don't do it every year, but I think it's been a little while since we've done it. So I think it feels like we're due to do it again. And then I'll stick this right in line, I think, maybe. Yeah, see, I didn't totally think this through, but that's fine. I think I'll actually go down a little and keep it out of line a little bit and just be a little bit almost off of the camera. It's all right. I think that'll be cute. And then I've got in here, I think it is, another sticker that I was, like, desperately looking for earlier. Um... Where is it? Oh yeah, these leaves. I forgot about those. So yeah, what was I most looking forward to? That's focus, Brittany, because that's what you're supposed to be talking about. Um, but we're gonna stick this right here. Even though this is a quote, I'm still gonna stick this here because I wanna try to bring in the foiling. So yeah, we'll put that there. So yeah, I'm looking forward to like um, the soccer festivals that we have coming up. Yeah, I think I do want to use these coffee mugs. It's gonna go with gold, but I don't want to go with gold foil on gold foil. And I don't think I have any others that are necessarily the right colors. Yeah, no, I was looking on my lap where I have my stickers right now. Um, so yeah, the corn maze. Hope we'll be able to do that one this year because I don't think my son has done the corn maze. Um, I'm really looking forward to Thanksgiving. I've already been talking to my husband about it, trying to figure out what we're doing for that. Um, my little cousin is getting married next month, so I'm excited to go to her wedding. And this is going to sound really silly. But I am excited for the leaves to all finish falling so that I can just go ahead and start leaf blowing. I love, <laughs> I love to do the leaf blowing here it, for our family. And I, I don't understand why I like doing it. I just do. Um, we have two massive like 40 year old oak trees in our backyard so the leaf situation in my house is pretty uh oh I could put it down here yeah I've got two of them so we'll just stick it right down here kind of center it off camera there we go um Uh, yeah, so we get, we have a lot of leaves that fall, and I love to blow them, oh, um, I, I love to, oh no, there we go, alright, I think I salvaged it, um, I love to do the leaves, like, about once a week, and then just take the kids out so that they can play in them, no, last year I did the leaves, and I had, because my daughter was only half day kindergarten, so she was able to, to come out and enjoy it and have fun in the leaves after I made piles for them. So now it's just me and my son because the girls are both full day. 
and let me get this out so I can see all of the leaves. This was a misprinted sheet that was in the middle of the summer section and Michaels gave me a really nice discount so I did not return it to Mandy because yeah I already got it cheap. All right oh all right I don't have a um like a meal planning sticker in the right color. Let's see I think what we'll do all right, I use this color once over here, so we'll use remember, and then we'll go Sunday, Saturday, Friday, Thursday, Wednesday, Tuesday, Monday, and then we'll just stick this right here then. So this is going to be for, for my meal planning. I like to do it in my sidebar, it's just, it keeps things consistent for me. Now, where did those leaves go? There we go. Um, yeah, I think one of the reasons why I love leaves so much is because I didn't have them when I was a kid. I grew up, I grew up on the beach on an island and like there were no trees growing in the sand. So yeah, I um, just really really love doing the leaves and letting the kids play in them because it's one thing that I missed out on. But then again, like I got to go up to the ocean during storms and just watch the, let's see how I want to do this. I mean, it was like this in there. I feel like I'm going to go this way with it. And, um, yeah, so that's, I kind of could have gone underneath a fall memory. So that was, it's funny because like when I see questions like that, my first thought is like, oh, a fall memory that involves my kids, you know, like it's just immediately where my mind goes and it's not like, oh no, how about something fall from your own childhood you know um so that is something that i didn't think about but yeah i uh remember going down or like taking a walk up to the beach to just watch the waves when storms would come through like i remember it was i guess maybe 96 tropical storm bertha came through close enough that it churned the surf up really bad and we'll cut that like there so I just remember going up and watching like the foam of the the ocean and everything and it was just it was just really incredible to see so I um that is a fun fall memory. Yeah, I'm going to use one of these other smaller, this was not like too small, but I'm going to use it. I think that'll work if I can get it off the page. I'm not the best with clear stickers. But yeah, so like I, I have fun doing the, the leaves for the kids because like it's just, it's so unique to me, you know? Do I want to cut these? I kind of feel like I do. Well, oh, yeah, let me cut them. I'll stick this out over here and put this one down here. Oh, that's a good idea. I like how that looks.
All right, I think I think that looks really good with all those leaves, but I do need to put down my um, popcorn sticker. So we're gonna go with like this tealish color. Yeah, I don't know if I wanna go with the orange. I kind of, yeah, you know what? Let's just go with the orange because it'll match the books and the trash can sticker from Lily Annabelle's Plans because this is also Lily Annabelle's Plans. Um, so, you know, this is like the second or third week in a row I've put these together. I need to remember to put Rosie on this side or put the box down here if I'm going to use this rosy facing this way. Um, but yeah, so I think the orange kind of keeps that all tied together. And I really like how I did match those, so that ends up looking really good. And I know that I was initially in the middle of a story about the ocean and fall, but yeah, this, this spread is good. I think I did... I think I did awesome. I have the quote that I was looking for, the two quotes I was looking for. This is great for the first day of fall. Yeah. So it's not exactly the way I saw um, Laisa's plan with me, or um, Paige, but I definitely think that this is me. I like it. Nothing going on on Sunday. Oh, I forgot my Manny. Oh well, I'll worry about that later. So this is my final spread. Make sure you guys can see it really well. Um, if you like this video, please be sure to give me a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. Make sure you go over to Bethany's page. She's um, playing with Bethy Dean. She's going to be doing a collab where she's going to be answering the same questions as well. Um, so go check out her video, subscribe to her channel. I love her plan with me's. Um, and be sure to be following the both of us over on Instagram and I will see you guys later.